Hi. Hey besties, I'm filming this in my window because it's the best lighting in the house. Oh geez, anyways, this is gonna be a bookshelf tour. Not every single one of my books that I own are on my bookshelf. I have a few that I just didn't have anywhere to put in like an ottoman. So I'm not gonna show those. It's not gonna be like a super in-depth book tour. I'm not gonna go through every single book. That'll be like an end of the year type thing. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna kinda show you what it looks like and show you what I've got on my shelves and my Funko Pops and stuff. So I'm doing it on my phone. So if it's a little shaky, I'm sorry, but let's get into it. Okay, so we're gonna start off with like my single shelf right here. And I'm gonna start from the bottom because it's just the quickest way. These are just, Books that I've read, books that I haven't read, just a mixture of books that I needed to put somewhere. I've got my Han Solo. I've got Lando back there and a big Dio, which that's my brother's, but he knows I love Star Wars, so he puts it here. My Baby Yoda AirPod cases fell. I definitely broke the bookshelf. I've read most all of these, except for like these three. Harry Potter, the Weasley Twins. This is like my main Harry Potter shelf. Um, you can see what it is. I have these books from like making of the movie. This is from um, The Crimes of Grinwald. This is like the special edition of the first book. And I have some Uno cards of Harry Potter, a Christmas ornament, some like cards. I have McGonagall's wand and the Elder Wand. And then there's like the Funko Pops. I have Snape, McGonagall, Newt, the trio, and then my paperback books up here is um, this is a letter that I got on Etsy and it's a letter from Draco. We're not going to talk about that. So this whole shelf is kind of random, but I have like my DVDs here. My other, my Blu-ray Harry Potter DVDs are upstairs in my brother's room because he's watching them. But I have Twilight, Fantastic Beasts, the four of like my OG copies, all the Maze Runner. This is two signed CDs from Daniel and Corbin from Why Don't We? Um, my classics. At least like my favorite ones, Midnight Sun. These are my friends, I have to mail to her. I have Cece from um, New Girl. Neville, Kylo Ren, the white versions of the Twilight books. These are so pretty, I'm not gonna take them out right now. That'll be a later video. And then I have my two of my Star Wars Funko Pops. This is my after show. <laughs> um, I have had some of these copies since they literally came out if you can't tell but like this is two of her other books this is a newer copy this is my og copy this is a signed copy movie um cover og copy two movie covers so i accidentally ordered a second one og copy new copy mm, kind of eh, copy i've got these three candles that i will inst i will put the girl's name here at the bottom i can't think of it right now but She's really nice. <laughs> and then this is my Bucky Barnes shield folder. It's, yeah, that's a thing for another time. Ben Solo, my king. Up top, I have my ears when I went to Disney for the first time in October. This is just a bunch of Lego pieces that I own. That my brother's given me and that I bought. Like I have like my Avengers up here. This 20th anniversary Snape. Obviously that's flounder. This is an owl my grandmother gave me. These are Harry Potter Pezzes that I don't know why they're laying like that. This is a plastic wand from just Halloween. This is a drumstick that the drummer from my favorite artist Evan threw to me during a concert. This, these are like my main two shelves. They're a little bit packed. That's Patricia. Say hi, Patricia. Well, we'll just start at the bottom and I'll point. This is books I've read and they didn't fit in the above shelves, basically. That's a signed book from the author of Bridgerton. My Dear Evan Hansen book, that's a basket of my crap. Those are obviously my Throne of Glass books. This one is just a, I have not read a single book on the shelf except for A Good Girl's Guide to Murder. Do with that what you will. I have read The Hating Game on this and then there's my Hogwarts letter. Oh yeah, there's Groot. There is Tom Riddle. That's my Hogwarts letter I got from Hot Topic. My shelves have literally zero, like, set up to them. It's just where I want them to be at the time. So just here we have my P-Dug books. 
spicy spicy we love we've got yoda which i got from hollywood studios when i went to hollywood studios in october there's a key um the only book of here i've read i've read all my p Doug books but i've read kingdom of the wicked which is the freaking i love the book so much over here we have my coho books read every single one of them love her my favorite fungo pop rory gilmore um i have not read a single one of those books but they're on my like they're coming up next i've got bucky and sam here obviously this is my stuff from the illumicrate box which you've seen if you watched the last video so i'm not gonna go too in the depth with it but look how freaking pretty this book is that's my dagger this is another jla shelf my main copies something from the titanic museum um a dagger necklace poppy book cover nargle from harry potter another dagger and then there's hawk up top is my book of the month this nyc thing is not a book it's like a tin it's got pictures and stuff in it luca candle Hogwarts. This is gonna be a really quick video. This is my lead art Bardugo part. It's the entire Grishaverse and then candles. There's my king. Here is some more JLA. Touch of Darkness. I have read all of these and these three. Here is my Akatar shelf pretty much. So I've got this ring for the night court that is a recent ring and special edition throne of glass and court of thorns and roses reese and then i have these over here and that is literally it that was really short but i just kind of wanted to show it so here's another look Patricia. 